Prince Andrew's lawyers have reached a financial settlement with Virginia Jufri, according to court documents. It comes after a civil sexual assault case was brought against him in the U.S. by Ms. Jufri. Prince Andrew has consistently and vehemently denied the claims. She had been suing the Duke of York, claiming he sexually assaulted her on three occasions when she was 17, allegations he has repeatedly denied. A letter filed to the U.S. District Court on Tuesday said the Duke and Ms. Jufri had reached an out-of-court settlement. The match of the day presenter has shared his thoughts about the news as he took to Twitter today. In view of his 8.3 million followers, Gary, 61, shared an article that reiterated the news. The article read, Hashtag breaking the Duke of York and Virginia Jufri have reached a settlement in principle in the civil sex claim filed in the U.S., court documents show. Gary penned, the inevitable settlement, followed by a wide eye emoji. A document submitted to a U.S. court said, Virginia Jufre and Prince Andrew have reached an out-of-court settlement. The parties will file a stipulated dismissal upon Ms. Jufre's receipt of the settlement, the sum of which is not being disclosed. Prince Andrew intends to make a substantial donation to EMS. Jufre's charity in support of victims' rights. Prince Andrew has never intended to malign Ms. Jeffers' character, and he accepts that she has suffered both as an established victim of abuse and as a result of unfair public attacks. The statement concluded, It is known that Jeffrey Epstein trafficked countless young girls over many years. Prince Andrew regrets his association with Epstein, and commends the bravery of Ms. Jufri and other survivors in standing up for themselves and others. He pledges to demonstrate his regret for his association with Epstein by supporting the fight against the evils of sex trafficking, and by supporting its victims. Richard Medelli's daughter Chloe announces pregnancy in adorable post latest be back soon Rylan Clark issues positive update after hospital dash health Rose ailing Alice shares kiss with dancer Luba Mustook pictures, Prince Andrew's representative said he had no comment beyond what was said in the document filed to the court. Buckingham Palace declined to comment on the settlement. Following a disastrous interview with the BBC's Newsnight in 2019, Prince Andrew stepped down from royal duties. However, it is believed Andrew asked Queen Elizabeth II to be allowed to temporarily return as a senior royal following the death of his father Prince Philip. But his older brother, and heir to the throne, Prince Charles is thought to be adamant there is no way back for the Duke of York. It comes after his military titles and royal patronages were removed last month following a ruling stating the civil case brought against him by Ms. Jufre can proceed to trial. In a statement published in January, Buckingham Palace confirmed, with the Queen's approval and agreement, the Duke of York's military affiliations and royal patronages have been returned to the Queen. The Duke of York will continue not to undertake any public duties and is defending this case as a private citizen. Lisa Bloom, a lawyer representing several of Epstein's accusers, welcomed the Duke's settlement as a victory for Ms. Jufri. In a statement on Twitter on behalf of her clients, she wrote, We hail Virginia's victory today. She has accomplished what no one else could getting Prince Andrew to stop his nonsense and side with sexual abuse victims. We salute Virginia's stunning courage. 